The August state primary right around the corner and tonight we continue our in depth look at Ottawa County where more than 30 people are running for 11 open seats on the county's commission. We sat down with almost every single person that will be on the ballot August 6, although a few did decline to be interviewed. Matt Whitcoast introduces us to those running in District 10. District 10 covers the city of Grand Haven, the city of Ferrisburg, and a chunk of Spring Lake Township. The current commissioner isn't seeking re-election. This is also one of the larger races for a uh, county commissioner. We have two Republicans and two Democratic candidates on the primary. The two candidates from each party will face off in the general election. I asked them, why should people vote for them? Take a listen to what they had to say. Because I have experience. I think experience is one of the key factors in this election. Uh, if you look at the makeup of the current Board of County Commissioners, not only is a flawed ideology in play, but a complete lack of experience in what it actually takes to run county government. Well, I think I'm going to be a different candidate than most people have ever seen. Um, I like to listen to both sides. I like to hear truth, honesty. I like to hear what people have to say, even if we have opposing views. Uh, even as a Christian, I would love to hear the views of an atheist. I think I bring a unique voice to the people of Ottawa County. Um, most of the members of the commission are business owners or sort of people with more professional jobs. While I, I come from a more working class background, I work at Meyer over here, over in Grand Haven, and I'm a member of a union. It, I almost struggle to say, like, vote for me. I, I like to tell people, consider me, because I don't, I don't like to just tell people what to do. I think people are, most people are very reasonable and can make their own decisions, but I want people to consider me because I'm, I'm a younger person. And Now these are just a portion of our interviews. You can find the full video and transcript of my conversation with each of the District 10 candidates up on our website. Reporting in studio, I'm Matt Whitkos, Fox 17 News. To see all of Fox 17's election coverage, grab your phone and scan that QR code right there on the screen. You'll be able to see all of our stories leading up to the primary and some key dates to mark on your calendar.